Treatment types of kidney disease People may need to take many medications to treat the symptoms and conditions that develop due to chronic kidney disease. In addition, a person may need to try one of the following lifestyle changes or treatments, depending on the stage of their chronic kidney disease. Diet Following a proper diet is a vital part of kidney failure treatment. Restricting the amount of protein in the diet may help slow down the progression of the condition, as consuming too much protein may overexert a person's kidneys. However, the specific amount of protein a person should eat depends on their body size, overall health, and exercise regimen. Nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs People with CKD should avoid nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, such as ibuprofen certain antibiotics, and the use of dye with a CT scan. This is due to an increased risk of side effects as a result of how the kidneys may metabolize these drugs. End-stage treatment End-stage treatment typically begins when a person is at stage 5 and their kidney is functioning at 15% of its normal capacity. It occurs when the kidneys cannot keep up with the waste and fluid elimination process despite the person making lifestyle changes making dietary changes, and taking medications. For this reason, a person will need dialysis or a kidney transplant to survive. Most doctors try to delay the need for dialysis or a kidney transplant for as long as possible because they can lead to potentially serious complications. Kidney dialysis Dialysis is the mechanical removal of waste products and excessive fluids from the blood when the kidneys can no longer carry out this function. Dialysis has some serious risks, including infection. There are two main types of kidney dialysis. They are, hemodialysis, a dialyzer, or an artificial kidney machine pumps blood out of the person's body. The machine filters out the waste, and the blood re-enters the body through tubes. This procedure usually happens in the hospital but it can also take place at home. Peritoneal dialysis the person's abdomen filters the blood. This takes place in the peritoneal cavity, which contains a vast network of tiny blood vessels. There are two subtypes of peritoneal dialysis, continuous ambulatory peritoneal dialysis, this usually happens while a person goes about their daily activities. Automated peritoneal dialysis, this generally takes place during sleep. Kidney transplant A kidney transplant is a better option than dialysis for those with no other health conditions apart from kidney failure. However, candidates for a kidney transplant may have to undergo dialysis until they receive a new kidney. A kidney donor and recipient need to have blood types that work together. If a person receives a kidney from someone outside, their body may reject it. Siblings or very close relatives are usually the best types of donors.